Well, the rarity of it is the fact that we saw it in the lagoon waters inside of the inlet. Yeah. Blow back into this well, it looked like it was in distress. So we, it was in shallow water, about two feet of water, maybe even less. So three of us got in the water to just assist the fish. And when we noticed that it was pumping its, its dorsal fin pretty strong, we, we made the decision right then and there to try and get it into deeper water and give it a chance to survive. Not hurt it was it's actually relatively strong. easy to get it into the deeper water. It was floating pretty, pretty steadily, and and so that process was not as challenging as you, as you might think it would be from an animal that's about 250 or 300 pounds. We are in the Narrows. Uh, near St. Lucie Inlet. Offshore fishermen are known to every now and then run into one. You see them at the surface and a lot of times when they're at the surface they're, they're they could be doing any number of things. Sometimes they're basking and they're, they're, they're getting some sun or it's been theorized that that because they have so many parasites that they're actually allowing birds to come in and peck parasites off of them. So in general when, when people do see them, which is infrequently, that's that's kind of the condition that they're seeing them in. Um, but it is an, it's uncommon, and uh, and if you see them, we would just ask to report it to your local FWC office, and we can report that sighting on to the proper uh, person.